off last year by one goal to nil to make it to Australia and New Zealand this coming summer. Love set pieces like this. Katie McCabe sending that one in towards the back post and it was nodded behind there by Louise Quinn, captain. Around missing a penalty in the shootout as her side went out. That ball played into the middle towards Sophia Smith. And again, patience by the United States. Dunn just looking to... Lavelle's ball towards Haran at the front post. Haran is down. There were two Irish players collided as they were trying to get it away. Really good ball. Causing some early trouble here. And Katie McCabe once again with this delivery. As it goes all the way towards the back post, it's cleared off the line. Rose Lavelle gets it further away. And picked up by Katie McCabe once again. McCabe swinging that cross in towards the back post. And Alyssa now can come and claim it. Ireland going close. First time. And now Mallory Swanson. Swanson with a good cross into the middle, but it's claimed there by... Three, two, well, this looks spectacular here at Q2 Stadium in Austin. What a place this is. This is my first game here. Love it. Always possible. Not an easy thing to choreograph 20,000 people, but <laughs> almost to perfection right now. Look at that. That is cool. Now there's space on the right side for Heather Payne. Place for Florida State University. Payne's ball driven in, and that's a save by Nair. Second time she had to scoop it away. Drops back for Denise O'Sullivan. Locked on the line, driven back in by Carew. The other side, Ireland. Getting that look at the near post, the, co the cross comes across. Nair swatting it away, missed the clear there. Sullivan getting a good look. Gurma able to clear it off the line, holding on. Caruso getting another bite at that apple. And Throw bodies forward, finally there's some space for Sophia Smith to bring it in down the right side. Swanson can't get there. There are some shouts for a penalty. Here's it on the other side, Ireland getting that look at the near post. The, co the cross comes across, Nair swatting it away, missed the clear there. Sullivan getting a good look. Gurma able to clear it off the line, holding on. Caruso getting another bite at that apple. And then on the other side, Mannion. Mannion's ball in towards the edge of the box, and now the space here for Katie McCabe. McCabe's cross in towards the back post. Really well defended there by Crystal Dunn. Dunn launching it long in towards Sophia Smith. Lovely turn from Sophia Smith and the block comes in and it goes behind for a corner. Louise Quinn throwing her body at that one. Great ball in by Dunn again and a good turn by Smith, but really there should be a second wave of runners coming in behind Smith. She could just lay off a nice little touch. Swanson's delivery once again, this time in towards Horan at the back post. And it goes out for a goal kick off Lindsay Horan. We'll chase it across to this near right side of the penalty area. And the keeper coming a long way to get there as it was being watched back by Megan Connolly. Picked up here by Rose Lavelle. Lovely play here. Comes back for Sophia Smith. She'll drive it straight towards goal, but Brosnan makes the save. On a day like this, it might take something special. A beauty by Rose Lavelle. Fakes that cross, gets them to bite, finds Sophia Smith. Good little first touch to set her up. Just doesn't get all of it. Emily Fox. Fox driving towards the edge of the area. Drills it low! Breakthrough comes from an unexpected player. Emily Fox with her first goal for her country. And you certainly wouldn't have picked her for first goal scorer today. <laughs> Just as the United States is having some success from the corners, Emily Fox picks it up deep. And here she is wide open again on this weak side. They don't press her. She says, okay, I'll create a
little space on the dribble, gets a hold of that one through traffic. And that is a well-struck ball by Emily Fox. Brosnan sliding across, just can't come back. And Fox from the distance gets him on the... Austin, Texas. This wonderful Q2 stadium. I mentioned the U.S. winning in the inaugural match to open the stadium. Beat Ireland for the second time in this half. Mallory Swanson is hurt. Being chanted around the stadium here in Austin. Died for Heather Payne. Payne up against Dunn. Payne's cross in is a good one, and it skims off the head there of Caruso, but the flag is up for offside. Payne charging forward down that right side. The floor. Katie McCabe with the corner in towards Alyssa Nair's goal, but that one drifting behind for a goal kick. Sullivan. The half-time whistle goes here in Austin. And it's a 1-0 lead for the United States. There's the goal scorer. A first career US goal for Emily Fox. But the first half overshadowed by the injury to Mallory Swan. Up against Payne. Done with the cross in the middle. It's a good one. Rodman's header down. And Aoife Mannion just watches it go wide. Again, the United States having success when Dunn can turn that corner. This one, a good one. Gets a little window of opportunity. Plays at a standards. Rose Laval carries it forward. She's got Rodman to the right side. Rodman! Here's Rose in the seam. Great ball into Trinity Rodman, and she does everything right with that first touch. Gets a little... Shit. It's done down the left side. Up against Mannion. Dunn's cross in, Rodman climbs, and saved by the keeper, Courtney Brosnan. Couple of opportunities now for Trinity. Th that's what you love to see and hear, too. She's yeah. grateful to be back. And she understands, like, I'm not just going to step in and, and win a spot. Around through for Hatch, laid off here for Rose Laval. It's a chance for Laval as it deflects on the way through. Brosnan was scrambling, and it's behind for a corner. Oh, that deflection almost, almost trickled by Brosnan down on her knees for the, the save off the first reaction, and then she crawls across just to get another hand on it. But Julie Ertz. Ertz back into the path of Sonnet. And now it'll come for Lavelle. Cleared once again, the block comes in. Holding on, I do love that Julie Ertz has decided to take up more of a 10 position rather than the 6. Coming back into this, she's like, I'm not staying. Gets it back for Lavelle down the right side. Rose Lavelle with a cross into the middle and the header over the bar from Lindsay Horan. Another corner. Going back to our conversation with Julie Ertz yesterday. I, I, what I loved is how nuanced. It, Swung in by McCabe, and that might even go straight back off the... Uh, swings the cross into the middle. Lindsay Horan getting on the end of it, and it goes behind. It's Horan to strike it, it's off the wall and behind for a corner. A bronze ball into the middle for Ertz. Let's ball towards the edge of the box. Haran tried to turn. She goes down. And the referee points to the penalty spot. Ireland furious with the decision from Carly Shaw McLaren.
It's Horan against Brosnan, and she scores. Brosnan getting a hand to it, but Lindsay Horan with the goal, with a little over 10 minutes left to play to make it 2 0. Another look at that ball in by Ertz Horan posting up. It's the tug on the back there by Caldwell. And then Horan going the opposite way that she did in the Lyon Chelsea game. And there it is. Hits it with just enough pace. Brosnan with a hand on it. Can't get a good enough swipe at it. And it's 2-0 to the United States getting some time is going to be huge in a game like this now Sophia Smith skips past the challenge but did she keep it in play she didn't it's a good it's her fifth appearance of the year Sophia Smith finds the way open up she'll shoot towards goal and then Hatch try to get on the rebound but it's a corner this is where Sophia Smith is just so good in that little seam lets the ball run across her the Red Sea parts Finds a little gap. Here's Sophia Smith. Now it's Sonnet. Sonnet's ball across towards the edge of the box. Driven in by Fox and saved by Brosnan. Well, she had to wait 